come. Time to meet and be greeted. I shan't stray a step from your side. Time to say hello. Go on long journey to be nice now. Once more, all the best in your new life. Thank you. It's so snow. Dearies, blessings rain down upon you. May you live in health and happiness. Harmony and love forever last betwixt you. Thank you, from the bottom of our hearts. Now go, enjoy the feast. Our turn. My dear friend Aldona and her chosen one, Jonas. It's an honor. The sun shine brightly on this new path in your lives. I am Vlo- uh, This is my friend of yesteryear. Geralt of Rivia. Yes, tis I, Geralt, a witcher. Heartfelt thanks for your hospitality. I adore weddings. The brides especially. So fragrant, so tasty, I could- Righto. I'm sure we'll all have a splendid time. Tell me, Aldona, how is it you and my dear Shani know each other? We met in Oxenfurt. Both studied medicine at the academy. Wondrous times. Over quickly in my case, alas. My family couldn't afford to keep me there. I was forced to return home after one year. It's never too late to pursue an education, my dear. Your husband is certain to help you complete your studies, provide the necessary coin. I don't know. We've not talked about it. Come. Jonas, surely you've not taken Aldona as a mere diversion for the alcove. You will help her, will you not? That is between me and her. You needn't butt in. But I'm not. I merely ask. See, I've come to love your wife like a sister. So I ask you, as your brother-in-law, will you help her? I'm sure we'll discuss the matter. <laughs> That's my lad. You're a right decent chap. I knew it from the start. Aren't you an extraordinary beauty, my dear? Why, thank you. You had your pick of gents, I'm sure. Where is this going? I'm attempting to discern why she chose you, Jonas. Mean you don't approve of my wife's choice? I've no skin in this game. I ask out of pure curiosity. Well, rein it in, or I shall have to explain my wife's choice to you, hands on. Out of pure pleasure. Why so testy, friend? Have I insulted you? Merely told your wife she was a beautiful woman, yet here I'm threatened instead of getting thanks. Have some manners. Geralt, that's enough. She simply fell in love, that's that. Jonas, I'm sure my friend meant no offense. Aldona seems a curious choice for a bride. Did she come with a hefty dowry? I assure you, Witcher, my choice had naught to do with coin. Jonas' family is far better off than mine. They have a textile manufacturer. It took a lot of convincing to get Mother to agree to our, as some would have it, misalliance. Toh! You never told me. Whatever happened to fortune is of no import to me and my family. It isn't. Jonas told me the same. That your background doesn't bother him. Never does. Not at love's first blossoming. But give it time. Five years and you'll find few things that don't bother you. I'm beginning to find what you say, Bobison. I don't know where you're from, but in these parts it is rude to insult newlyweds at a wedding. Insult? I'm merely warning you. Know a thing or two about life, you see. <sighs> Geralt and his jests. He has a strange sense of humor. Very strange, I'd say. We've chewed the fat enough. Time's a wasting. Are you uh, expected elsewhere? Me? Ha! I simply cannot wait to sample your liquors and dance with the local matrons. Jonas and I invited more than a few lovely maidens. Perhaps one of them will catch your eye. Oh, that's for damn certain. And perhaps you will catch one of their. It'd be nice, certainly, but I shan't be terribly bothered if it's not the case. Come, let's drink. <laughs> 